Hello guys, here's the program to Inspire. Welcome to the fifth part of the 15 puzzle game series. So in this tutorial, I created this image that I'm going to drag and drop into our uh, our 15 puzzle folder. So let's create a new folder, call it rest for uh, resources, and I'm going to drop this image here. And this image is going to be in the description. So uh, go into the properties, job build path, and add class folder, and check the resources folder and apply and close. This has to turn into this uh, icon. Now let's go into the sprite class, and here we have to create some new uh, things. So public static int array of not int array, a uh, sprite array, sprite array of bg for backgrounds is gonna be create sprite. And the path is going to be this bg.png. Create sprites, create this method. And here it is going to be buffered image, image is equal to image io dot read sprite dot class dot get resources of path and here change this to path and int import int w is equal to is equal to image dot get width and int h is equal to image dot get height int array of pixels is equal to image dot get RGB delete that zero zero W H now zero and W sprite ray of sprites is equal to new sprite ray of sixteen we are gonna have sixteen sprites for in y is equal to 0, y is less than 4, y plus plus, 4 int x is equal to, x is equal to 0, x less than 4, and x plus plus. Uh, we are going to have to surround everything with try and catch, so bring this inside try and catch block, and inside uh, the for loop, we are going to have int uh, array of pp stands for pixels uh, in 100 and well, 100 all our sprites are gonna be 100 times 100 for in yy is equal to 0 yy is less than 100 yy plus plus and the same for x so copy paste this change this to xx and this to xx and this to xx xx pp xx plus yy times 100 is equal to p x plus x times 100 plus xx plus y times 100 plus yy times w make sure the parentheses are in the right places and after that sprite x plus y times 4 is equal to new sprite of pp. We're gonna have to create this constructor and after all that we're gonna return sprites or return null if we made an error somewhere. And here, uh, this dot width is going to be 100, this dot height is going to be 100, and this dot pixels is going to be new int width times height for int i is equal to the, here it has to be is equal to 100, for int y is equal to 0, y is less than height, 
y plus plus for int x equal to zero x is less than with x plus plus pixels x plus y times with with is equal to pp x plus y times with now this should be it for this class so go into the game class and i'm gonna copy paste this array again down here and comment this out and now let's check if it works it does so turn off shuffle and you see this is our painting so you can try to solve this now if you have time so guys thank you guys for watching and see you in the next tutorial series